Hey guys, welcome back again to my channel Electrical Point. I hope you all are safe and sound and I hope you all are at your home and no one is going outside of your homes. Anyways, now today I will show you how to design this kind of multi plug boards. I hope you all are familiar to this kind of boards. This in this kind of boards you can use uh, four plug points or more than that at the same time okay so you can charge many appliances at the same time okay so guys i will show you the complete connection of this kind of multi plug extension boards okay and after watching this video i am sure that you will be able to make this kind of boards at your home by yourself okay and after at the end of this video i will open this board and i will show you the connections practically what are the connections that are inside this board okay so guys watch completely the video and guys let me tell you if you are new to my channel please subscribe to electrical point and don't forget to press the bell icon and also guys share with your friends so that they can also get the benefits now let me start the video now guys you can see this is a grade white multi plug board and there are four plug points here and this is the main switch to turn off or turn on the board okay and you can see you can see this is the fuse to cut off the supply to this board when there is an emergency now if i turn on the switch you can see there are leds glowing here so, and it is indicating us that the board is getting the supply now i will check with the tester you can see tester is glowing in this plug also tester is glowing okay now same okay tester is glowing that means these plug points are getting the supply okay now if i turn off this switch you can see tester is not glowing that means this plug point is not getting the supply okay so this switch is provided for this plug and this switch is provided for this plug and this switch is provided for this plug first of all i will show you the connections of this board with pen and paper and after that i will open this board to show you the connection of this board practically okay so guys be with me and watch completely the video so guys let me show you the connections now so you can see here our first point is this is this is the fuse this is this is the fuse okay so this is optional if you want the protection to this board you can use this and if you don't want then don't use the fuse now if you want to connect the fuse you what you do you directly connect the fuse wire to this fuse okay and after passing through this fuse the fuse wire will go to this main switch okay this is the main switch this switch is this switch okay now after uh, after uh, doing the connections of this switch what you do you take this fuse wire to this led lights this is the led lights this led lights is here and this is also optional if you want to install this then only use it and if you don't want then don't uh, put this led lights here okay now you see what you will do now your neutral will come okay now see this neutral will go to the LED lights okay then only this LED will work okay now guys after completing the connection of this LED what you do you to take the phase wires like this way okay to this switch okay now join these phase wires to these three switches this this and these three switches okay so connect the phase wires to these switches okay and you connect the phase wire from this switch to this plug point okay and similarly this uh, phase wire will come to this plug point and this phase wire will come to this plug point okay and there you can see we will need one more switch here okay to connect the phase wire to this plug point okay and see you can see this phase wire will come to this plug point okay now we have done the uh, connection of the phase wire now you see the connection of the neutral wire okay after you can see i have uh, completed the neutral wire connection 
up to LED. Now you what you do, you take the neutral wire like this and directly connect to the neutral points of the plug points. Okay, you can see I have connected the neutral wire directly to the plug points. Okay, now our next connection is our ground wire. Okay, you see. And you can also directly connect the ground wire to the plug points. Okay, you can see I am directly connecting the ground wire to the plug points. You see, so this is our actually complete connection diagram of this multi plug board. Now, guys, you see if I open the fuse wire, okay. Suppose I have opened the fuse wire like this. You can see I have just opened the fuse wire. Then what will happen? The phase will break at this point. Okay, so there will be no supply to this board. So the board will not work. Okay, and similarly, if I turn off this main switch, then also the phase wire will break at this point. So the board will not work. And what will happen? Then this LED lights will also not glow. And suppose if you don't want to use this LED lights, then what you do, you directly connect the neutral wire directly to the plug points and phase wire will directly go to this switches. Okay. I have simply skipped the LED lights at the this point. Okay. And guys, if I tell about this main plug or this main cable, you can see there are three wires in between this cable okay the neutral phase and the earthing cable and guys be careful when you are choosing the square meter of these cables okay because if you uh, apply these wires uh, of lesser diameter and your load increases here then these wires will melt so always use the proper rating of the wires wire size according to your requirement or how much load you want to connect on this plug okay and if you want to calculate the perfectly the square meter size of cables according to the load you can uh, go to my video and the link is given on the description box and you can also get the video by clicking the i button given on the screen okay so guys now i will open this board and i will show you the connections what are the connections inside this board okay so guys you can see I have just opened the board to show you the connections okay now see this is our the main plug point which is connected to our switch board okay so through this cable we have three wires the green it is the earthing line the, the black one it is the neutral and the red line is the phase line okay now see the phase is going to this switch over here and after this point the phase is sorted through these two switches also see this point and this point okay now after going to the switch you can see on the other terminal the phase line is coming out and it is going to the plug point okay now you see we, we will now give the neutral line so neutral is coming to this point and it is directly connected to the other points of the other plug points okay you can see this is sorted in these four points and similarly the earthing or the ground line is also sorted this point this point this point and this point so our uh, four plug points will get the ground line and you can see this board this is nothing but the pcb board to give us the led lights which are in the uh, back side of the board okay and you can see this is the fuse before going to the the this plug points the phase is coming through this fuse so to uh, break the circuit when there is an emergency so guys i hope you have understood the concept and enjoyed the lecture so guys if you have any doubt you can freely ask me on the comment box and guys don't forget to subscribe to my channel and definitely press the bell icon to get the notifications of my videos and also guys share with your friends so that they can also get the knowledge so guys see you in our next video so till then be safe take care and thank you for watching